real world while writing programs we may require uh, we may have to choose make a choice from multiple alternatives so how the choice can be made is by using this cascade if else selection structure so how that can be done we will understand this concept by using an example a very classical example so in this example we are going to provide grades for the student by using their scores so here i have taken this example in this example the initial value of score is it is an integer value the score value the value that is assigned for this score is 85 now we have to allocate grade for this course so how that can be done so first uh, here the multiple alternatives are provided if the score is greater than or equal to 90 then we have to provide a grade a now is this true no it is not true now we are going to uh, we are, we will be uh, we, we are going into the else part of this if, if condition now within this if, if within the else part of this if condition i have written another if condition if else part so now now what this if else uh, what this if is checking for is if the score is greater than or equal to 80 now if this is true now we are going to provide the grade as b so what is the score the score is 85 now what's happening here is we have verified whether the score is greater than 90 or not now is it true no it is not true now if if we, this is not true so we have come into this else part now in this else part we are verifying the score whether the score is between 80 and 90 or not now is it true yes the 85 is between 80 and 90 now if this is true we are going to allocate a grade of b now with this uh, we, we have allocated the grade let's assume that the, the score is 65 now how this is going to this is going to uh, verify from all the alternatives that are available let's check that so initially the score is greater than or 90 uh, greater than or equal to 90 is it true is 65 greater than or equal to 90 no so we are we are coming into this else part now within this else part i am going to check this if condition so this is how sequentially we are going to write the if else structures so that we can make a choice from multiple alternatives so that kind of writing the program is what we call it as cascaded if else selection structure